Hi everyone. We just want to make sure we get those briefcases in the shot. Do you have that? <laughs> yeah. Careful, that light is hot. Thank you. Is that 13 member? <laughs> so what's this is our spokesman over here? What's in the briefcases? We have in these briefcases the envelopes for tonight's show. We're very proud at Ernst & Young to have been doing the Emmys for 20 years. And uh, they engage us to do lots around security and confidentiality, make sure this thing goes off without a hitch, and that's our job tonight. All right, so can, if we can, just have you hold up the briefcases and say hi to the troops overseas okay. and say we're at the Emmys. You know, we're, we're here at the Emmys, um, and we, we, we celebrate great freedoms in this country, including to have an event like this. It's because of the sacrifice of our men and women in uniform, and you're never far from our thoughts and prayers. So thank you all for your sacrifice, and uh, enjoy this, just like we will. Thank you. Have a good night. Give a shout out. Okay. Here we go. Oh, here we go. I'll hold it. You just okay. want to go ahead and look at the camera. And what do you want me to say? Whatever shout out you want to say. To all our troops serving overseas and at home, thank you for your service. We appreciate it. I am launching a new bag. I'm actually the spokesmodel for Just Because for uh -huh. Breast Cancer Awareness. Oh, because I, I, like many other people, will not wear pink. But I will carry a little pretty black bag. And this, and the proceeds from this bag benefit breast cancer research. Okay. It is pink inside. It is pink inside. Ah, pink on the so inside. It, it, there is pink in there somewhere. And my stepson is a Marine. So. Oh, he is. Okay. He is. Cool. Good. We'll have to do Thank you. We're going to have a great time. You are, yeah. You're dressed for it. I we are dressed for it. <laughs> <laughs> and Love I will you. come out on a USO tour, I promise. Love you. Are they coming down that you see? We loved you, yeah. Hi. So we haven't seen you guys' name first. So yes. Just what show you're from and stuff. Sure, and no then problem. Then just go ahead and Look at that camera. Okay. This is Kent. And this is Vixen from The Amazing Race on CBS. We want to give a special shout out to all the troops watching. We heart you guys. Thanks for keeping mm -hmm. our country safe and for defending our honor day after day. We love you guys. We love you guys so much. Yeah, I'm an Army brat, so <laughs> my heart's definitely with you. Uh, the Army's my family. You know, just come home safe and be strong. Thank you. We love Her you. Her dad trained me for The Amazing Race. <laughs> he took me out on the boot camp. He took me out on the obstacle Repelling, course. So yeah. He made a man out of me. <laughs> <laughs> or tried it. Believe least. it or not. Yeah. So do you think that training really made you get, get ready for that mission? We would not training? have been as successful as we were on The Amazing Race. We probably wouldn't be standing here today on behalf of the Race for the Emmy Award if it weren't for that training, to be quite honest with you. Right. Yeah, he did good. He did good. So you're an army brat. Where, where, where yeah. have you been? Oh, goodness. Everyone has an, a laundry list, right, of places. Yeah. Um, see, Colorado, uh, Washington, D.C., Norfolk, Virginia, um, uh, Georgia, Fort Mac, uh, Marquette, Michigan, um, Germany, however, in Germany, um, Chicago, yeah, all over. <laughs> the list goes on and on. Isn't it yeah. fun? Now, didn't, little did you know you'd be on the red carpet. Especially because of the army training, right? It's, I know Wonderful. it's shocking. Yeah, yeah. There's a it lot works. of there's a lot of surprises in our family. My dad probably didn't expect me to have pink hair either. So, oh well, yeah, that's not in the army code. No, right? it's probably not in the code at all. But yeah, he's awesome. We're so close. So I'm really lucky. Well, good job on the training. If you Thank guys weren't you. looking so good, I would have you make put, do push-ups to prove it. <laughs> uh oh. Well, thanks for letting us off the hook. Thank I appreciate you. it. All right. We'll see you guys. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Bye bye. Okay, we are so thankful to the troops. Thank you so much for everything you do. When I give thanks every night, I thank you twice. We love you. We appreciate you. We're there for you. We love you. Yeah, and, and I just want to double that. We want to thank the troops, um, especially the reserves and all the people that gone into Houston, Texas. Um, you know, there's still a lot of people out there that are affected by the devastation of the hurricane. I am one of those people, but I made it here. And, um, you know, there's still 1.4 million people without power, and there's a lot of people that cannot go back to their homes. So we just want to thank you guys for all the hard all work that, that you, you do. All that you do for us, every day, every thank moment you. of every day. Thank you so much. Okay. Hey, how are you doing? Oh, so you've been on a, a lot of USO tours. Yeah, I've been on four USO tours. I've been to uh, Pakistan, Afghanistan, all the stands, uh, Korea, Guantanamo Bay, Fort Hood, I've been all over. 
Well, why do you do those U.S.O. tours? Just because, you know what, it doesn't matter what you feel, if you're well, for the war them. or not for the war. But I'm for the men and women that are protecting us so we can live our lives here. And we need to support our troops. And I'm for them. And I want to show them that they matter and that they care. And what they're doing is very important. And that's why I do it. Are you surprised to see them on the red carpet? Oh, I are you kidding? I'm thrilled you're here on the red carpet. I'm, I'm one of the governors of the academy, and this is the 60th anniversary, so it, it, it's 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 terrific. It's a great night. Can we do one more before you go? Just look straight into the camera and say say hi to the troops and uh, actually so they know your name, what what show you're yeah. from. Yeah, I did, I did it over there. You want to do the same thing over there? And you know you look good too. Hi, I'm Kate Linder. I play Esther Valentine on The Young and the Restless. And I have had the pleasure of doing four USO tours. I've been to Afghanistan, Pakistan, all the stands. I've been to Korea, Guantanamo Bay. And we are all for you. We know you men and women work really, really hard. I've been there. I see what you do. I know how hard it is for you. Don't give up. There are people here that care about you and love you, me being one of them. So, and please, please, take care of yourself and come home soon, safe. Thank you so much. Have a good night. Have a good night. Thank you. Guys, what happened this week? The economy tanked. Uh, Obama <laughs> and McCain are calling each other names. Palin has not taken any interviews. Uh, let's see what else. Um, we have the Oscar, the Emmys, and uh, nothing else good happened. But hey, cheer up. <laughs> What's your name? Kathy Justin, Desperate Housewives. All right. Thank you. I'll enjoy it. Still enjoy, yeah, that's for sure. Oh, oh, hi. Nominated for 30 Rock. Yes. Excited tonight? Uh, no. 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 Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> I know, it's a given <laughs> question, right? No, 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 no. <laughs> Let me tell you, uh, I've never experienced this before. And we got like 17 nominations, so I'm kind of excited. Okay, well, this is kind of a different question. Okay. Do you have any military ties? I do. I, no, I don't. Not any immediate military ties. I have a lot of friends of mine who I went to NYU with who are now over in the military right now. Uh, so, you know, I'm thinking about them. One, my, my roommate, my roommate uh, for my, my sophomore and junior and senior year uh, is over in Iraq right now. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. All right, yeah. Well, good for you. All right, well, congratulations. Thank if you. If you could, just look up at the camera, just say your name. This one. This one. Oh, this one. Say your name, what show you're on, and whatever message you have for the church. Okay. Uh, hi, my name is Keith Powell. I'm on 30 Rock, and be safe. And come home soon. Good luck. Thank you. How are you? All right. What uh, what division are you guys in? Division. Yeah. What is this? How does it work? It's we are with the two two two. Are you in the? Are you guys Army, Navy, Air Force, or Marines? Army. 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 It's the green. It's the green. What are you guys? Navy. Navy. <laughs> All right. Congratulations on the nomination for the office. Thank you very much. This is a crazy question, but are you excited to be here tonight? Uh, no, I'm pretty much, I'm going to go take a nap now, like under the bleachers. Yeah. No, I'm thrilled. <laughs> this is so awesome. I mean, we got all these great TV stars here, and uh, it's so exciting. I, I can't even believe it. I have to ask you, do you have any ties to the military at all, friends, family, anything that you know? Boy, you know, a lot of guys I went to high school joined the military, a lot fought in the Gulf. And uh, say hi to a bunch of those guys. Mm -hmm. uh, let me see. Chris, I don't know what thing they were in, though. You know what I mean? I don't know what, <laughs> what do you call it? What Army, na that? branch of the armed forces they joined. <laughs> well, so, okay, we're all one. It's all Chris Army Cole and Brian Hertz, and uh, wish them all the best. So. Well, if you want, we want, we really like you look straight in the camera and say, hey, I'm really Wilson. Big, we're all a big fan of you, so if you can say hello to the troops. Hey there, troops. I'm Rain Wilson. I play Dwight on The Office. Fight the good fight. Rock on. All right. <laughs>